headed to a doctor's appointment. So obviously after the news that we received, um, was it last week? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so after the news that we received last week, now we're uh, headed to get some close monitoring. To check up on the little people or person, should I say, uh, baby A, to make sure that they're still healthy. Um, and as you can see, mom is still getting a nice little snack in. She washed her hair this morning, so like she's like really, really tired. Because um, obviously you're exerting a lot of energy considering that you have pregnant. So that's it. Uh, we're on our journey to the doctor's appointment. So, uh, so yeah. She's getting ready to go in. She's finished eating her food. <laughs> you feel better now? Yeah, I do. Good. That's important. I want to make sure you get all your food she's got to put her mask on all right so she's already left uh, i figured i'd give kind of like my thoughts and feelings on everything but yeah this uh appointment will be very um very significant obviously as we had shared in the other video that obviously we had a miscarriage of one of the twins which is baby b um this ap appointment will be extremely important because obviously we need to monitor baby a to make sure baby a is moving along and everything is happening well with that baby so um, my thoughts and feelings are excitement because I haven't seen um, baby A um, except for maybe like the very first ultrasound we had which was um, in a different city with a different doctor so this would be great to actually see the child um, and also to get a better understanding of um, what happened with baby B so Amber was able to explain some of the information to me but obviously she was taking in a lot when she was given the information so this will be great to, um, to get some more information as well as to see baby A. So I'm excited um, and pretty anxious. So we'll see if I'll even get an opportunity to go into the um, to the appointment because things are definitely different <laughs> with uh, with the, with COVID. So that's it. On in. <laughs> All right, so good news is um, I just wrapped up going into the ultrasound. So excited, saw baby A. Baby A is doing really, really well because um, we're at 12 weeks with the process. Um, so excited, really, really, I know I keep saying excited a lot, but just excited. Um, the baby looked extremely healthy, so that's obviously a positive. So um, again, close monitoring for this week as well as for next week to make sure everything is kind of off and running in the right direction. And then also to trying to think um yeah so she's wrapping up phase two of the appointment which is basically where she gets to speak with the doctor so only thing i was able to do was actually be able to see the ultrasound and then now she's going to have the appointment with the physician to kind of go over like i guess next steps questions and concerns like that so um more to come sorry about earlier i know larry was recording and i wasn't I um, was really hungry and I was trying to get through the appointment and it's over now and quite honestly I'm really tired at this point but I just wanted to recap my thoughts from today um, so we had a good appointment it definitely brought back some feelings and emotions that I felt during the last one um, but it was good to see the kids again even though baby B is no longer um, on the growth journey baby A was alive and well and we just talked to the doctor in more detail about more implications of things that have happened and um I think one of the biggest takeaways is that he assured me that it was nothing that I could have done or that I did um for the outcome that we had so um that was really helpful the appointment was pretty long so I'm pretty drained right now honestly but I just wanted to get on really quick and say hello. Um, I'm sure Larry said that we have another appointment next week. So we'll go back and check up on things again. And for now, I'm probably going to rest a bit. It's a really nice day outside, actually. So maybe I'll take a walk. I haven't been exercising for the past few weeks, which I really, really miss. Um, so I'm going to try to work my way back up into exercising again and all of that getting back to normal I guess so closing in on this first 13 weeks I'll talk to you guys later